Hello, this is Victoria Wynn. I wanted to show you my little um, photo table and just things that I pick up when I'm out and about. Could be yard sale, could be something on clearance. You only need a little bit of background decor to make your art really stand out. So for instance, one of my most common little uh, background um, pieces is this little I don't know, succulent on a twig <laughs> um, because I can just have like a little part of it showing. Let me find some art and I will give you a little example. So let's say we take our little twig right there. We move a few things around and um, just such a simple way to make a photo um, come alive is to have a little background foliage, some kind of flowers, some kind of leaf, and like so. I'm gonna put my greenery in the background a little bit more for this piece. And pretty much just move it around till you feel like your foliage is not overtaking your piece of art but merely just giving it a fresh or a homey feeling. That's all you're going for. Do not make the background flower, you know, the, the focal point. You do not want to distract people. You almost want them to not even really think anything of it and just think, wow, that's a really, really lovely photo. Here, let's go back. I'm not satisfied with my favorite succulent for this particular piece. Maybe we'll go with something simple. Maybe we'll just add a little flower. So again, these things I just find at yard sales or clearance from a craft store. So simple, something like that, where you just see it a touch in your photo. Not a big deal. That one, you can't really see it because of the way that I would want to shoot this. So maybe it would be a little more like, no, I think the flower is the winner. So this is the exact reason it's nice to have some variety around. I'll just set my art on the petals and then click photo just like that. Click, simple, simple. And really the trick is just keep your eyes peeled when you're out and about and just start collecting little things. Another one um, that I really like is this basic tray. It's just on clearance at some craft store. Um, super beautiful to lean art on, um, jewelry, pendants, or small pieces of art. Same with this one. Think of things in all different um, shapes and manner of design. So you could just have it leaning on its side. You could have something coming out of it. But remember, that is not the focal point. Your beautiful art, your amazing jewelry, your gorgeous resin pieces, that's the focal point. For more tips on organization, sales, marketing, photography, visit the winmodernart.com blog and I have a whole whole lot to share mostly because I have a whole whole lot of experience in the world of marketing and artistry. Thanks guys, this is Victoria Wynn.